We're going to see a big reset in 2015 and 2016 when it comes to telematics, because most devices out there are on AT&T's 2G network, which is sunsetting. And that means a lot of fleets that have already adopted telematics will be forced to choose new hardware. There's still only about between 20 and 30 percent market penetration, but as 2015 and 2016 goes on, there's going to be a big reset in our space because the vast majority of devices out there are, are on the AT&T 2G network, which is sunsetting over the next two years. So even the companies that have adopted GPS and telematics, uh, they're going to be forced to choose new hardware. And while they're going through the trouble, which is really the biggest challenge of, of telematics these days, is doing, and it's not a big challenge, but it's a challenge, doing the installs of these devices. While they're going through that trouble, they may as well reevaluate their service providers and their, uh, and their software providers. So we see that as a huge opportunity. There's 20 million trucks in this country. There's arguably 25% market penetration. Half of those folks need to choose a new vendor, so it's wide open. There's a lot of competitors out there, and everybody's got a niche. Um, we tend to earn our business, especially our large enterprise business, on the fact that we deliver consistently the largest ROI to our end customers. And we do that by uh, consulting with them, understanding their costly business challenges, helping them to use our product or adapt our product, or even we'll customize our product to help them to see significant ROI. We just had a, a very large utility customer come back after their first year as a customer with a roughly two and a half million dollar savings uh, on account of our the implementation of our product that was about a 400 percent return on investment. So if, if we can help deliver that large ROI, not necessarily the most inexpensive product, but certainly the most um, able to help save money, that's where we're earning our business these days.